And now we're going to turn to new details on the investigation into a high-speed roller coaster shutdown after a crack was spotted in the support beam. Rhiannon and Ali joins us with the latest. Good morning to you, Rhiannon. Good morning to you, Juju. Yeah, these images are really shocking. They show a now closed North Carolina amusement park ride seemingly on the brink of disaster, raising questions about inspections and also rider safety. This morning, new details on that terrifying crack in a North Carolina roller coaster support beam. The state's Department of Labor Elevator and Amusement Device Bureau now beginning their investigation using cranes inspecting the large fracture through a steel pillar of what Carowinds Amusement Park describes as the world's tallest and fastest giga coaster, the Fury 325. That group of people will work together to determine what is the corrective action that needs to take place in order to get the equipment back into a fully operational safe state. This as new questions emerge as how that crack was not spotted and addressed sooner. I said, that's catastrophic. And I don't have to be an engineer to know this. You guys need to shut this ride down now. Jeremy Wagner had been at Carowinds all day with his family. As the kids went on Fury 325 one last time, he saw the crack and sprang into action, taking video, immediately showing it to employees. The shocking video shows the coaster rounding a turn. As it passes the beam, the crack appears to open and close, the pillar itself shifting as the train of passengers zooms by at approximately 95 miles per hour. It's one of those things that you know, anybody can make a mistake, but you know, this isn't anybody's mistake unless they just didn't catch it when they should have or could have. Carowinds releasing a statement saying the ride will remain closed until repairs have been completed, adding safety is our top priority. As part of our comprehensive safety protocols, all rides, including Fury 325, undergo daily inspections to ensure their proper functioning and structural integrity. Melissa Pinto says her son was also on the ride. Terrifying, terrifying and they said they inspect their rides daily. How did something this big go uninspected? A lot of questions. As for that coaster that's under investigation, the state last inspected it back in February. No violations were reported. Industry experts point out that millions of Americans enjoy amusement park rides every single day. Injury rates are actually extremely low, but when you see this video, it's obviously very concerning. It only takes one time. Yeah. And it's the amount of time that passed mm -hmm. after the crack was first spotted, too, that gets me. Yeah. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.